This video is going to go through a method of mixtures or thermodynamic equilibrium example. If 550 grams of aluminum at 85 degrees Celsius is added to 1450 grams of water at 15 degrees Celsius, find the final temperature of the mixture. In a problem like this, in a closed system, the amount of heat energy lost by one object will equal the amount of heat energy gained by the other object. This means that the value of Q, or heat energy, for both substances will be exactly the same. Before we go any further, let's write down everything we are given. We will use the subscript L to represent the substance losing heat, which in this case is the aluminum. We will use the subscript G to represent the substance gaining heat, which in this case is the water. The specific heat of aluminum, or C sub L, is 0.22 calories per gram degree Celsius. The mass of the aluminum, or M sub L, is 550 grams. The temperature of the aluminum is 85 degrees Celsius. Again, since the aluminum is losing heat, it gets the subscript L. Now, the water is a substance gaining heat, so it gets the subscript G. C sub G, or the specific heat of water, is 1 calorie per gram degree Celsius. The mass of the water, or M sub G, is 1,450 grams. The initial temperature of the water is 15 degrees Celsius. We are trying to find the final temperature of the mixture. Since the heat energy Q for both systems will be exactly the same, we can set the heat energy equal to each other. This means that C sub L times M sub L times the change in temperature, or T sub L minus T sub F, is equal to C sub G times M sub G times the change in temperature, or T sub F minus T sub G. In both cases, our change in temperature will equal the hot temperature minus the cold temperature. So when the object is losing heat, the initial temperature is warmer than the final temperature, so we have T sub L minus T sub F. When the object is gaining heat, the final temperature will be warmer, so we have T sub F minus T sub G. Next, we need to use a little algebra to rearrange the equation to solve for T sub F. We will skip over the details in this video, but make sure you try this on your own to solve for T sub F. T sub F is equal to C sub L times M sub L times T sub L plus C sub G times M sub G times T sub G. All of this is divided by C sub L times M sub L plus C sub G times M sub G. Our next step is to substitute in all of the values we are given. Be very careful on this step as it is really easy to enter it incorrectly into a calculator. 0.22 calories per gram degree Celsius times 550 grams times 85 degrees Celsius plus one calorie per gram degree Celsius times 1,000 450 grams multiplied by 15 degrees Celsius. In the denominator, we have 0.22 calories per gram degree Celsius times 550 grams plus 1 calorie per gram degree Celsius times 1,450 grams. Using the order of operations, we see that the overall final temperature of the aluminum water mixture should be 20.4 degrees Celsius. This concludes our thermodynamic equilibrium example.